welcome back to some more Simu Croft. So, I've gotten a few buildings built, and I have to sadly say that the first three or four people are dead now. They died around the ages of 117 to like 123. So, they're gone. We still have Patricia, though. She's going on at the age of 117. Sadly, um, that has made our population smaller, but we've gotten a lot more people recently. They've been coming, and it's very nice. So you're probably wondering why I have this bucket of lava here and this glass. Well, I had a subscriber suggest to me, hey, why don't you get a fin tender and uh, light up some cows? And I tried that, but it's like near impossible because there's so many cows. So... This is the best way I came up with, was to put some lava there, let it drop, and just watch them burn. <laughs> I don't know if they're going to get pushed through it or not. It doesn't look like many people, are, many of the cows are getting burned. Let's let it flow a little longer. There we go. <laughs> oh no, is the lava going to catch my fencing on fire? Oh, the cows are dying! La <laughs> Fences. Lava proof. Yes. Well, dang. That really settled things down. My frame rate just stabilized immediately. Look at all that meat. If I get in there, am I gonna get burned? Yeah. Whoa, Tom B Bump Fondle. Watch out for that lava. I'm sorry about that. That was my fault. I let spread too much. Ah, oh, he's burning. He is burning. I think he's gonna be fine. I think he's lava proof, at least. Come on, please. Yeah, he's fine. He's fine. Cows, seriously, stop complaining. This was meant to happen. You're just all in a big area. We need to clean this out. Whoop. Ah! Gosh, that does a lot of damage. Oh, the uh, fences are catching on fire. <laughs> Bad idea. Bad idea. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna come over here and die. Oh. Wow. I made a mess. I made a huge mess. I hope I didn't lose anything. Oh well. Let me stabilize my stuff real quick and put that on and that on and I think we're fine. Yeah, we're good. All right, guys, just let that that settle. Watch out for the lava, guys. It's real dangerous. It'll go away eventually. You just stay here. I don't have any fences. I'll patch it up later. Alright, bye. <laughs> oh, okay, so. On to the buildings. Hey, Jamie Griffin, how's it doing, buddy? So, I guess the first one I'm going to show is that big tree house back there. Its name is Huge Tree House. It's literally what's called. And it is quite massive. I would say that comfortably. It's got some nice hedges on the outside. It's perfectly symmetrical if you look. Got a little flower garden. But nothing too crazy. Pretty nice though. And then you go up. You got your first level here. But you can't really see too much. It is getting pretty crowded out here. Lots of buildings. Ooh, double enchantment tables. Okay. That's cool. Whoa. A new mucus has moved in. That family. I know them. 
they've been here before. And, oh, did I go straight to the top? My bad, there's a second floor. <laughs> Can't tell much of a difference. There is no enchantment table, so. And this part, this up part right here, I added actually. You can't go to the top in the original design, but I mean it's a treehouse. I should be able to get to the top. So, hot air balloon. That is one of the new buildings. This is probably the best time to mention it because you can't really see it very well from other points. This is probably one of the best points you can see it from, and it's got multiple colors. And then the base is down there. I might make a ladder go all the way to the top because I think it'd be cool to have like a lookout. We'll see. We'll see. We'll go over there and check it out in a moment. So let's go down. So this is actually residential housing. The huge tree house. This is someone's house. Somewhere. Let's see. Andrew Kitchen, age 27, is the only resident here. Huh. I don't even know that guy. There's so many new people, I don't know all their names. Oh. Are you a girl? This is the new mucus. Uh, chibi? Shibi? Chibi? Chibi? Yeah, you're definitely a girl. Yeah. <laughs> well, welcome to my town. Uh, I'm just calling you C Mucus. Welcome to my town. Woo! Ah! I didn't expect to make that, to tell you the truth. I knew I was destined to fail. Alright, so that's the first new building. Now the next two ones is... This is supposed to be a futuristic gl glass house, I think, or wood house. Futuristic wooden house. There is apparently a resident, and it is a sheep. <laughs> it says there's a resident here, but there's no one here, so that's kind of weird doesn't give a name either for a few streets a house it doesn't have much commodities it has a bed you know it's supposed to be the future I guess it is this guy's house is sheep I don't think he can do much and then this is the hot air balloon uh, this is the bottom of it I don't know how this is supposed to work it isn't this futuristic house is residential housing but sadly, this hot air balloon is not. It is considered other. So all it is is for looks. But you know what? I wanted it. Because it's a hot air freaking balloon. I see what you're doing here. Don't don't get crazy with that. I like my grass. Yeah, so I added the pathways to them. But that's all that's new. Um, I mean... That futuristic house is pretty simple. The hot air balloon, I thought was a cool little thing. But that huge tree house it actually took over a thousand logs. So, yeah. That was quite intensive. That's all it took, though. It took only logs. But, you know, it's done. It's finally over. And it took forever to build it. I had like three. No, I had four people building it because it was just so long. Oh, wait. I built four things. I'm so stupid. I'm sorry, guys. I forgot about back here. There's an igloo. I knew oh, there was something else. I thought I was missing something. Hey, Sheila. Klutz. How you doing? So, Sheila, this is your house. Tomb Raider. You live in an igloo. <laughs> Uh, what do you think about that? You like it? Is it nice and cozy? Let me check it out for you. I like these lights. Yeah. I like these redstone lamps. And... Another enchanting table. Quite quaint, you know. I mean, it has everything you need in it. To live, at least. And some, so... I think I can... Yeah. <laughs> There's a fencing around it. I don't know what that's for exactly, but sure, why not? Oh, it's getting dark. Ow. It's getting nighttime. So, let me go to sleep real quick, and I guess I'll show you the last thing 
I wanted to show you guys before it's time to call the end of the episode. I wonder, do I have any extra fencing laying around? I have four fence. Too lazy to make fence. Let me eat some of the- oh wait, I got steak. Screw you, bread. I'm eating steak. Didn't burn my fencing down for nothing. Oh, wow. Oh. This is not good. Not good at all. Yeah, I'm gonna fix this up real quick. Ah, dang it. That stuff is annoying. Lava. Ah, oh, it's just gonna come back. So I guess I gotta do this kind of dealio. Stomp it out. <laughs> oh, I need more fencing. Ow. Do I have water around here? I. Where am I located? Yes. There's water over here. Can I make it? Can I make it? Ah. Uh, uh, ah. Uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna soak in it just cuz. <laughs> oh man. <clears throat> so I guess I can just get rid of all this real quick. Um, bun funnel, that's great. You can get out of that. That's fine. Don't you don't need to be that near that lava. It's my fault. I caused all the problems. Man, lava, you just are annoying. You want to spread out? Ah, no, not again. Not again. She, Patricia, I'm using your water. Ah. <laughs> oh, yeah, you saw me come over. Oh, it's fine. Everything's fine. Don't worry about me. You're 118 years old now. You're getting up there. I should worry about you. Jerry Griffin, man. I can't believe you're 53 already. Gosh, I feel like you just came to the town the other day as a teenager. You're an old fart now. Time flies when you're having fun. Alright, so I'm gonna leave that glass block there. Cause. I don't know, maybe if I just. Like, uh, put a hole here, and then the lava will flow into the hole. But th that wasn't the problem. The problem is I let it <coughs> extend to these other places, I guess. I, I don't know. I'll figure it out some other time. Uh, good luck uh, keeping those cattle in there. Patricia's there. She's watching you. And Jonah Hather. Hello, you're new. How you doing? I like your outfit. You look pretty cool. You're like a little bumblebee. Oh, you're with Jerry Griffin. Oh, that's good to hear. Wow, 23 years old difference. You must uh, really like him for his money. I mean, or just love him. I mean, I'm not really expecting you to love him. I mean, 23 years is difference. That's quite a, ma a difference. Alright, so. There's water down there. Let's go. <laughs> oh! <laughs> and you hear the... My miner's working away. We got Jose Yog, diggy diggy hole. Where's your buddy? There's supposed to be two of you doing this. Did he die? I don't know. Anyway, so this actually, you wonder, like, what the heck is that torch doing there? This cut into one of the pathways I was at before. See, this is the first mine right here. I mean, it's kind of expected to happen, I guess. But, uh, yeah. That happened. So they still dig even though the water's there. Like, they won't get rid of the water. So it's just, like, getting deeper and deeper. But they're going to dig a hole to the bottom anyways. But I don't know what I'm going to do about that water. Because by the time they finish, that water is going to be so deep, I don't think I'm going to be able to get it out. I mean, removing water in Minecraft is extremely difficult. And I don't know how I'm supposed to do it. Maybe there's something in Simucraft that can get the water, like, help me get rid of the water. Like, I know there's, like, a landscape feature. I don't know if there's one for water. 
I don't know if anyone knows how to get water effectively, but that is a lot. Any hoozles. So, that is the new stuff that's been going on in SimuCraft land. Um, next time, more buildings, yay! Because buildings, yeah. And I'll probably have more structures like that where just for fun, they don't actually have a purpose, but you know, they add you know, kind of a variety and I like the way they look into the game. Someone suggested uh, putting in a hotel. Turns out there's no hotel building, so as soon as someone makes a schematic for a hotel building, <laughs> I'll get right on that, but at the moment there is none. So, until next time guys, this is Mbot signing out. Peace.